What is going on everybody? As you can see I finally got my mic back and as you can also see we got a new truck or I got a new truck and this is going to help us out a lot for the business because obviously we have a lot more space to store and uh, carry our equipment with us and there's a lot more going into why I got a pickup truck rather than a van or uh, any other kind of skater trailer but I just wanted to talk about our plans going forward for this pressure washing season. As you know from last year, we did pretty well. We did pretty good with our two 2.5 GPM machines, but this year we're looking to upgrade. We already went to Harper Freight yesterday to look at uh, to look at the Predator 4 GPM machine. Done some research on it. It looks decent. It looks like a pretty good washer uh, for the money. But we're still trying to figure out what is really going to maximize our efficiency because we have we do have two guys. We don't have enough jobs yet to where we're uh, going to be sending two guys out. We're still trying to figure out that whole issue of. Uh, what we're going to do if we only have one 4 GPM machine connected to a house and we can't uh, because we most likely can't connect another 2.5 to the house as well because that would just be drawing too much water for the house to handle so uh, we're going to be figuring that out I'm going to keep you guys updated I'm not going to talk about marketing and everything that, everything that we're doing uh, to market for this year but I will talk about that in the next video and go kind of into more specifics on what we're doing with the marketing but for right now um, our biggest plans for this year is to just upgrade our whole system, get our efficiency down because right now it takes us way too long to wash a house. It takes us way too long to set up everything, to break everything down because we don't have hose reels. Uh, we don't have anything that's really actually efficient. We have low GPM machines and although we are able to do jobs fairly quick because we have two of them, um, it's still kind of just a whole process of lugging the machine around the whole house, going every few feet having to break, um, pick up the power washer and roll it over um, a couple more feet. It is just a very, very inefficient process right now that we are trying to work on, but in business, these are things that you got to figure out. Wait, that's just how business is. You find out what's, wor what's working, what doesn't work, and then you uh, build off of that. You just try to maximize your efficiency and get the most out of your dollar and get the most out of your time. And uh, that's pretty much what we're focusing on this year. We also are going to be adding gutter cleaning. We wanted to add junk removal as well, but for right now, I think that's going to have to wait because we have too many other things to figure out. So um, adding that is just going to be a little bit too hectic, but we do want to add gutter cleaning to um, add some more seasonality so that we could work more in cold, cold months as well because it gets real cold here in the Northeast. Also, well, we want to start implementing this use of contracts. So we want to start getting people on contracts to do maybe a yearly house wash and two or three gutter cleanings uh, so that we could really start maximizing our annual revenue. So uh, that's pretty much it for things that we are going to be implementing in into our business. And I will be talking about all of the marketing and everything that we're doing on that side of the business in the next video. So definitely stay tuned and subscribe. Thank you for watching.